The Division of uh, Artificial Intelligence Research at UMSOD is poised to transform uh, diagnostics uh, because our focus, our mission statement is uh, transparent AI. So creating interpretable or explainable AI models that will allow clinicians uh, to see why and how predictions were made uh, to build trust within these AI systems. Uh, explainable or XAI, explainable artificial intelligence uh, and interpretable uh, AI are very important to the, uh, the beliefs that uh, Dr. Salter and I share. It can be developed, AI can be developed so the program will explain how it makes its decision as it goes along. So that's explainable. Uh, AI or interpretable AI is a little step further so it, uh, the clinician that uses the decisions that AI makes will know how to interpret the results. These are generating models uh, such that clinicians uh, can better understand how um, or researchers can better understand how a decision was reached by the AI. So rationale based um, reporting of uh, different attributes, weights and features in the AI model to help people understand how it works. Those rare diseases that the dentist may only see a couple of times in their career, that can he, can, he or she can then be assisted with a diagnosis. So that's one great use. Creating databases uh, that will allow uh, us to mine large uh, amounts of data, large volumes of data, such that if a rare disease were to occur and a clinician uh, had a query about it, we can go back to our extensive a database and match features and, and that would ultimately help with early uh, diagnosis and prediction. So this example here is uh, using AI for image segmentation and image segmentation is using features on any clinical image. Um, in this case it's a cone beam CT uh, x-ray and what segmentation does is it breaks down the different features of an x-ray and it provides a color-coded system. And in this case, the AI has uh, uh, very sophisticatedly highlighted uh, areas in pink here, which are carotid calcifications or carotid atheromas. And if these are detected early, they can prevent things like stroke and MI, myocardial infarction. Uh, the issue is, as we know, dental practices are very busy uh, and um, not all dentists have the appropriate training or the additional training to review things in the skull base or in the neck. And so what AI models like the one we've illustrated with our recent publication can do is it can highlight very small subtleties, uh, very minute um, calcifications that could be indicative of an early referral to a cardiovascular uh, specialist. Having the division of uh, artificial intelligence research anchored here in the Department of Oncology Diagnostic Sciences will provide us the ability to use our resources here in diagnostic sciences and with our future growth to push forward um, the diagnostic use of AI in a way that we've never seen.